Yeah, what's up? Are we going to start? Yeah, you were going to start. Okay. Should you start? Who starts usually? You, you do. So maybe you start today. It's really good. I don't know how then. I don't know how. <laughs> <laughs> Roll that intro. No, 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 no. That wasn't it. Okay. <laughs> See, I know. It's stressful. What's up, everyone? <laughs> <laughs> that was terrible. I know. I'm scared. <laughs> okay. Hey, guys. It's Jenna. No. No, I'm me. Hey guys, it's Jenna. I'm Justine. And welcome to episode 15 of the Same Brain Podcast. Same Brain! Ah, roll that intro! Oh boy, wow, wow, wow. Wowie. Wow, we. Hey guys, what's up? How's it going? So we officially have launched our YouTube channel. Justine, can you believe it? I do because that was the most insane stressful thing that I think we've ever done. You know what's crazy? Trying to export, upload, make thumbnails, and coordinate uh, 14 videos to upload, which are are all over 30 minutes. And like 60 plus gigs each. Insane. Even more, actually. Yeah, insane. I'm pretty sure Spectrum like just canceled our accounts after that. They're like, what are you doing? But you know what, Justine? It's up. It is. People are seeing the set. They're seeing our smiling faces. And you know what else? This is great. You know what else they're seeing? I got a haircut and look how blonde it is. This is like, this is like Justine 2011. Yeah. Yeah. 2011, except the brows are way better. I also got a haircut. Our dog Maddie also got a haircut. And you know what? I don't think Tyler got a haircut yet. (laughs) Tyler didn't get a haircut, but maybe, you know, he's he's thinking about his hair a lot. So that's good. And we can actually show you guys Maddie's haircut. I remember it was like episode like three, four. It was somewhere between one and 14 where we talked about him getting a haircut. And they're like, okay, but we can't see it. Today he you can see it. looks like a Q-tip. I filmed this video well, of Maddie and a Q-tip and I couldn't tell which was which. I mean, it's not. I mean, I could because it was like a, Man, was I, a Q-tip. Almost <laughs> I hope you could tell I which mean, is like, which. I could. Um, we're going to go and try to do our best to do the best job that we can do today. Today and- we're going to do our best job and we're going to start off our podcast by reading as well as listening to our reviews. So we're going to start off here with the Apple podcast reviews. This one says, you help me... I'm pretty sure it means refill my spoons. You Re- guys- refill, Refull. Refull. Refull my spoons? Well, we talked about- Refill? Remember, remember refill? Last, last episode, we were talking about the spoon method? Yeah, but is it refill or refill? refill. You help me- it's, re- it's refill. Okay. The spoons are filling back up. You guys got me into podcasts and I had listened to some before and they just were, let's not say, very entertaining. I found oh. Justine on YouTube, loved all of our stuff. And when I found out she did a podcast, I said, let's try it. Ever since then, I found myself staring at my phone for hours on Saturday waiting for the new podcast to drop. You guys are amazing. Keep up the good work. I bet there's some Saturdays you're staring real hard. Like real, last Saturday real when there wasn't one because we had a special edition and then it took us so long to do that one that I was like, we're not doing Saturday. It's the true. special edition or no. Yeah, I yeah I agree. Two in yes. one week is just way too much work. It's a lot. Ooh, yes. Hi, she- it's me again. I still use this to fall asleep, but very recently my migraines have been very active. This podcast really calms me down and helps soothe them since I don't have to look at the screen. Love you both. Thank you so much. <gasps> migraines are no joke. They're no joke. I'm also so sorry if we're screaming during your migraine because yeah. that's also not great. But thank you for uh, leaving all of your reviews. There's a bunch here and we appreciate all of the kind words. And also, Justine, still five stars. Oh my gosh, I'm shook. Woo, okay, I'm, now what do we have I'm over- gonna have to give us a review. Is it, can we review ourselves? I feel you're like- You're an individual. So I am my own probably self. probably could review. Yes, we, we should leave our own review and then read our review next week. No, we're gonna read theirs, Justine. Well, yeah, but we're gonna read theirs too, but then we'll all be right. like- we can probably yeah. do that. What so, you got for us for the voice messages on anchor.fm slash same brain. I don't know what happened with anchor the other day, but uh, I don't know if you get the notifications, but it kept, <laughs> I got like 45 notifications that said we had a sponsor. And then I got 45 emails that said that we had this. I think there was some God. bug. And then you logged in and it was actually, it was like some sort of charity thing. So that it actually wasn't a sponsor and you wouldn't actually make money for it, but they spammed it so much it was crazy maybe you, it was you, a plan it might have been anyway we're gonna listen to some stuff this is from uh from krish hey guys it's krish, krish. i'm just want to say krish. i'm a really big fan i'm so happy you guys got on youtube because i always prefer to watch than listen please keep up the good work and post every week 
Thank you. Oh we're, my we're goodness. We're trying to keep up the good work and post every week, and we appreciate you supporting our new YouTube channel. Yes, no, this is awesome, and I'm so glad that people are enjoying it. Also, Justine, what did you do for our YouTube channel? What did I do for our YouTube channel? Oh! <laughs> So we have captions now on all of our videos. So I went and did the backlog and initially we we're like, oh, we'll just do the ones starting from, you know, when we start doing it again, because it takes a lot of time for them to all get submitted and go through because it is a human that does all the captions. And they also charge you per minute too. So it's um, definitely, you know, we have definitely lost money on the podcast yes, like officially, have. officially. But I think that like, this is a really good investment. Mm -hmm. I told Jen, I was like, honestly, if one person benefits from being able to read our podcast, so worth it. I agree for sure. So from here on out, we're going to definitely work on having the captions. If it's not active as soon as the, the podcast go live, sometimes it takes a while, especially because someone's manually going through and reviewing it and uploading the captions. Yeah. So they will be there. Very, very excited about that though. And I think for the past couple of years, all of my YouTube videos have also been all captioned and yeah. And it's really easy with Rev. Like you basically mm -hmm. submit it through YouTube and then they submit the captions back and like that's it. Yeah. It's magic. It is, well, it's, it's, it's technology. So let's listen to one more here. What about Joseph? Hey, Justine. Hey, Jenna. I just Hi. want to say that I absolutely Hello. love your podcast. It's great. Each time an episode comes out, I'm straight the way listening to it on my home pod or with my AirPods. Oh, okay. Yeah. We're friends. Wait, home Immediate. pod? I never even thought of that. You've never thought about listening to a podcast on a home pod? No, I just have my home pod turn my lights on and off. I'm, you're a disgrace. I'm well aware. Well, I mean, not, not, <laughs> oh, yeah, not in any other reason except for that. That's cool though. I feel like that, well, I don't know. I have mine like downstairs. So like if I'm not downstairs. Joseph then... has more to say. Absolutely amazing podcast. Yeah. Um, Justina and Jenna, I've both been watching your content since I was young. Um, so I've kind of grown up with it as well. It's absolutely amazing. I love the videos that you produce. Um, Justine, I love your backdrop as well that you use. It's absolutely insane. Thank you, Love Tyler. the lighting and Tyler everything. Tyler does it all. Um, keep doing what you're doing. You're producing amazing content. Um, also, where I am here, we've currently just gone back into lockdown, so things are a little bit tough, but I'm uh, getting through it. I hope you are both keeping safe um, and whatnot. I've also sent a little donation as well. Oh, my God, Just to kind of help God, out with Joseph. the podcast. Sending you so much love from the UK, all right? Peace. Joseph. Joseph, oh my gosh, thank you so much. And thank you so much for your donation. It's really crazy console. to think about like the fact that like people are going back into lockdown again. Oh my gosh, you know? I know. It's... And it's also strange because I was reading this article when this all first sort of happened and it was like the stages of grief is basically like what everyone is going through. But now I feel like I've sort of accepted that this is- This is life. Like this is it. Like yeah. last night I went, or a couple of days ago, I ordered some new cute masks. Oh. Oh my gosh. I was looking too, but I forgot to hit order. So there's this one that I got. It was actually very expensive. And I was like, okay, I'm going to just test this out and see. And then I didn't realize that this was like a very popular mask and like they were like sold out very, very quickly because I saw it on Bloomingdale's. Oh, really? And so I got it. And then I went to get some new filters and like, sorry, all sold out back order. And I was like, I just bought this like two days ago. This is crazy. The filters or the masks or? Both, all of them. Oh, well, I Which, still have some filters. If but you this is a very me. specific filter. So I think that's kind of the see. issue is it is made specifically for this mask. And I, I can't pronounce it. It is like. You air, sent me the link. I, I signed up for the, the notification. Air Trium. It's from like Sweden or something. Hold on a second. I'm going to look it up but it's really, really well made. And it's like, I don't want to use it now because I don't have filters. Oh yeah. And it's so, 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 so nice. Okay, so it's Aaron, A-I-R-I-Num, Aaronum, Aaronum? And the packaging, like the unboxing experience of this mask was amazing. Like the packaging, their design, oh my gosh. everything, but it's all sold out and I can't get any of their filters. So it says they're doing 1% for the planet. It's an alliance of businesses that understand the necessity of protecting the natural environment. The intent is to help fund diverse environmental organizations. So not only are the masks really nice, but they're also for a good cause too. And they look really cool. And they have a pink one too. Ooh, I'll have to check that out. I definitely signed up. So if when I get, you know, an in stock notification, I'll have to do some show. Oh, wow, that is expensive. <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh yeah, it's $75. Can you like throw them in the wash or like, no? I need to do a little more research, but it was so comfortable. 
And because it does have that filter that you can switch out. I mean, this is that this is, is nice, definitely yeah. a very high quality mask. And it has these little um, these little air filter things that are little clips. So you clip those on. It's really, really Yeah, neat. that does look cool. I mean, look at this. Like this is all custom to fit. This is our and future. They have a bunch of different sizes. They have some for kids and the ear straps are also adjustable. adjustable. And they have um, a little headband. Thing oh that's going my gosh. It. Well, that looks, how many, how many do you have? I only got one. No. I, I mean, because it's expensive and I didn't want to. Like, when has that stopped you before? Um, I think when I realized that uh, the, our jobs are not guaranteed forever. It's actually very true. We're only getting older over here. I'm rotting before your eyes right now. Same. <laughs> All right. Um, no, I think I've just been putting more effort into, I feel like, like I, the things that I used to spend money on before, like manicures, I don't care. You look at this. Don't care. I mean, I've I have accepted that my nails are disgusting. I mean, I was. I've, it's funny because no, it's actually. But it's not like funny. it doesn't even matter. Like yeah, who cares? Like, like what? This Although is, I will say, looking at old pictures, I'm like, man, my nails look so I nice. I also was watching old videos and reviews. I'm like, oh my god, that manicure does look. Crazy. I know, but, anyway, but think about anyone. how unhealthy that is. Very like, you're unhealthy. Literally putting poison on your skin. I mean, I definitely did put poison in my hair to get it this color. But that's not your natural color. Oh my God. Tell no, them. look at Call TMZ. I call them up. Tell them. I mean, I haven't had my hair this blonde in really a long time. It's, it's I, I was bored. She was like, look at my hair. And I looked at it. I go, whoa, it was whoa. very, very bright. But we have a lot of other things to talk about. We do have actually happening. a lot of stuff to talk about. We made some, some notes today. Should we talk about? We need to talk about it. The ring security drone. So Amazon kind of had like a hardware um, the devices, we, the Amazon uh, devices the, event. The Amazon devices event, that's what it's called, where they announced a lot of very exciting things. And this one really, really caught our attention. I mean, people were saying this is the worst idea ever. And then other people like me and Jenna were like, this is yeah. incredible. All the I, tech people were hyped. Hyped. Okay, it is a ring security drone that freaking flies around your house if there's motion it detects. I like it. I love it. It I is it. the best thing ever. And yeah, you know what? I see your safety concerns, but you know what? Meh. Anything can happen. You, um, my concern though is I, I probably wouldn't want it to be active when the dog was at home. Oh, well, no, absolutely so, not. No, so, pets or kids. I mean, you probably wouldn't leave your kids home alone. Well, like a, I mean, I guess baby a baby home. Maybe, I mean, you, you know, you guys probably, probably, probably frowned upon. do that. But yeah, pets, I definitely wouldn't want to no. do that. No, because that's, that's too scary. But it's really great it freaking flies around your house can you fly it uh i don't or does it just like do its own flight i think path? it does its own thing i mean we really didn't get much information uh the charging dock blocks the camera's view and the camera only records when it's in flight ring says the drone makes an audible noise when flying so it's obvious when footage is being recorded yeah no kidding I'll i mean think, well yeah i mean expected you, to cost 249.99 when it starts shipping next year well, like Ship if you're getting this year. thing of you know what it's gonna do it's not like this is being forced into your home yeah you don't have to get not it. like you put this in your house now i'm putting it's it in my for house for a very select few consumers or people who you know, want this technology. But here's the thing. It's like, you also have, a lot of people have ringed on like the outside of their doors or even like I have Nest cameras like inside. Yeah. And There's I mean, cameras everywhere. It's like, you have to know that they're there and know that like, if you have these devices, there is a chance that it's going to be, it could be exposed. It's very so true. It's very, very true. Don't go walking around with no pants on. No in front pants. Of the nest. Doing the no pants dance. No pants dance. It's like, like this. That's like that. It's like this. I got no pants. So I'm yeah, doing, I'm. I technically couldn't have any pants on right now because you can't see my bottom. <laughs> I never want to wear jeans again. I don't think I will ever. I, so we're taking pictures later, and I brought a pair of jeans Ew, over. No, and I thought <gasps> I'm not even gonna fit in these. I don't think mine will fit. I don't even think they will. So that's another problem. Anyway, the drone looks cool. I will be getting one, and I, I'm excited and to very excited. As well, yes, I was I, I was just trying to talk in between you talking. I was uh, looking at a text. Our friend Farouk asked if I set up my new watch yet. Farouk, our friend Farouk. Farouk's the best. He I have not best. watched his A7S three video, but I have been honestly ever since we got this camera. The thing that I've been most looking forward to is his review video. I know. Same. Oh my because gosh, the camera, Justine. <gasps> we're shooting on it right now, and it's officially shipping. If you have submit or if you got the like, pre order, you know, back in what July, I think July, yeah. Mm -hmm. They're officially shipping. I think some of them might be back ordered. 
I wonder oh if gosh. mine shipped yet. Mine, one is expected to be delivered or was delivered on Friday. The other one is going to be delivered on Monday. I mean, so. I have made the decision that this is the camera that we're shooting on now. Like, No, for all- sure. Like, It's going to be replacing... Yep. all of our cameras and it's just going to make my life so much easier like having the flip screen because a lot of the times i'm just like shooting things by myself and i'm just like let me just do this real real quickly and i can flip the screen i could see myself the autofocus still uh, says order in progress are you sure it's also being shipped to your house because I'm, i didn't know if i was, I was shopping where i would be wait really yours hasn't shipped yet no Oh. Do you think that we can like maybe just, well, I was gonna say, would we fly to New York to B&H and see if we can just no. knock on the door and say, hello? They're not gonna answer you. Yeah, you're right. So that's so not that still says order in progress, but either way, uh, we did get one so far that we got as a review from Sony. So thankfully that's yes. what we're shooting on right now. I'm very excited to see the footage. This is the first time that we're shooting the podcast on no. the A7S three. It's gonna look good. I am just excited because we've been using the Ninja, which I absolutely love. The footage looks incredible, but the file size, they're really, really large file sizes. So the Sony, they've been doing a really great job at compression. Tyler has Our fallen. Friend Tyler he has, has fallen. He's on he the has floor. fallen. He's on the floor. He's fallen. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> we, we gotta get Tyler a mic. I'm okay. He, he said he's okay. We as gotta he, get as he exclaimed from the ground, he didn't fall. He, he dropped didn't fall. Something. Um, yeah, the storage. I, so here's the thing. Like I recently told Justine, what that are we talking about? I delete a lot of things from <gasps> my computer and I don't save. And she was like, "What is wrong with you?" I'm like, "I have an eight terabyte MacBook and That's I have it. like some external drives, but I'm just really bad at. I need more, and I do. I just like I just need to explore different options. I need different storage things. I need help." I've filled up two servers. I mean, I'm honest, like I just also now filled up the jellyfish server. So I've been going in and I'm like, okay, is there anything in here that I definitely think might be redundant or I have duplicates of? Because I mean, that's 75 terabytes. Oh well, it's my God. 96 terabytes, 75 usable. That's, that's a insane. freaking lot. I know. Yeah. So I need to definitely explore some different options because I don't want to be deleting this footage, but it, like in the heat of the moment, I'm like, you have to just go away because I need space now. That's why episode two is gone. Oh, oh, RIP. I know, I know. In the heat of the moment, I deleted the heat of the it moment. from three drives. I deleted, from, <laughs> I deleted from my computer. I was like, oh, it's fine because I have a backup of it. And then that was on my computer. I was like, oh, I'm out of space. I deleted it. I just and then you. Sorry. I was desperate to make some space on the drive for Tyler who was editing a video. And I was like, oh, I can delete episode two. And as I hit delete, I go, that was the third redundant copy of it. And now yeah. it's gone. I Mistakes mean, I, I, I mistakenly deleted three copies of it. Yeah. Well, while we're talking about cameras, we were talking about cameras. We're going to talk about how Ring announced a new line of security cameras for, for your cars. cars. Uh, have you ever had your wheels stolen off your car? <laughs> Not yet, but mm. they could be getting taken from the driveway right now. Yeah. You know what? I've had the wheels stolen off my car. I remember because we, was, I was, I was, I didn't live here yet, but I was staying with you at the time and. I had to go to a meeting Yeah, and I go down to the garage and I never talked about this online. I usually don't talk about terrible things that happened in my life. Well, you never no, talked about this? No, I don't this? think I did. Oh this my God. I was like, I guess it's, 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 you know, it's been a while, I guess I'll talk about it. Uh, so I went down to my garage and I looked at my car. Actually, I might've talked about it. I don't remember either way. Went down in the garage, saw my car up on like those Coca-Cola like blocks that like the, the bottles, like the crates, yeah, yeah the, the bottles would come in. And my mind could not process what I was looking at because my wheels were not there. They were not there, they were gone. And, and this was like an underground garage. Yeah. And my favorite thing is when you call it like AAA or whoever, they're like, cool, we'll send a tow truck. And in my mind I go, how are they gonna tow a car with no wheels? Well, and then I had to call them back and I said, oh, you guys remember it, that this car it, doesn't have wheels, right? And they go, Oh, good point. Yeah. And I'm like, well, you literally have one job. Yeah. So, so then did they bring? No, so I ended up having a Mercedes come out and they put wheels on the car, like not very well. I mean, they, they put them on good enough that Just to, they could like get it to the shop. And then we took it there and then they did all the whatever. Did you know that there's wheel locks and that yes. wouldn't happen to there you? Are, they're like a dollar. Yeah, the guy goes, that's weird. Like, why wouldn't you have wheel locks on this nice car? Like, I go, well, what? Well, Excuse me, well, why weren't they on there to begin with? What do wheel locks look like? Question mark? What do they look like? How'd they even get in your garage? Uh, that's a question that we're not sure of. That's, I mean, I think they must have followed me in. 
And or like, this is like an old location. Actually, I think the, the side gate was probably open. But Either you know what's way. gonna be really exciting for the new line of cameras for your car? Because it would probably alert you if your wheels were being taken off of your car or if there's if someone hits you, maybe you're parked. Yeah. Or um, I heard during the demonstration they said if you're getting pulled over, you can tell Alexa that you're yeah, getting pulled over getting and pulled it over. can activate the uh, camera. There's a lot of a lot of things happening and they it's better to be documenting. Said that you can have Alexa delete everything I've ever said. That was when they were like, Del- delete everything I've said. I'm like, oh, I love it. It's so yeah. simple. How do I get that for I think it's real prob- life. I mean, oh, yeah, you can't. Um, <laughs> I don't even need that. <laughs> okay. Maybe for the laugh track. Cricket, cricket. What's the other one? Uh, the drum. Dun, 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 I hate that dun. one. I don't like that one at all. Um, don't do that. All okay, right. What else I've we, gotten you, in trouble. You want to talk about Luna? Um, so the car cam can send alerts whenever an event such as break-in, towing, accident is detected. The owners can tap into the camera's feeds to see what's happening. It relies on Wi-Fi or LTE. How so is it I think, powered? It Does only, it say how it's, it's powered? It's first partnership is with Tesla. Uh, you just plug it into one of the things. The things, the you things where the you things. plug things into. Oh, the so things, their first right. partnership was with Tesla. So makes sense. Okay, I get. I it. don't have one. Um, a Tesla. That have the Sentry mode enabled to be able to install a device. Their cars allow them to connect to the car's existing cameras as well as view footage. That's cool. I'm yeah, into it. Cool. Pretty cool. When you get your Cybertruck. Oh my god, I forgot about that. Oh well, you. Are, oh, did you order one or two? So I actually speaking of saving two. money, when you said you don't like, you've been getting into saving money. How many? Yeah. Cybertrucks have you ordered? Oh, well, I, well, I have two. Oh my God, Tesla Cybertruck gets huge pre-order, but one big detail remains, what? Probably colors. Probably the fact that you could pre-order it for a hundred dollars. Yeah, no one, like, I wanna know refundable. the cancel rate. Yeah, refundable. Look at, that thing is not cool looking. Oh, well, it's cool looking, but it's really not. It looks like, it's, like one of those remote control cars that like you would just think, see little kids have like at the beach or like on rocks or something. Oh, I want a Ford Raptor. I want a Rivian. I mean, I want to take this. Oh, I do own a Rivian. Rivians are cool. Rivian looks cool. Yeah, real cool. Oh man, real cool. Like this looks. It looks like what a cyber truck would look like. I like that. Is that metallic? It's like shiny. Yeah, I just. Well, gosh, I just don't know. I don't know how I feel. It's okay. You don't have to know how you feel. There's we all be- don't know how we feel. There's between half a million and six hundred thousand customers on the wait list for cyber truck. That's a lot of freaking people. I was gonna say I thought it'd be more. Really? It's think, like a think about how many every other car in Los Angeles is a freaking Tesla. It's just like a yeah, cult. It is. Tesla, it, Tesla, 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 te- everything is a Tesla. It's because there's really not another option. There's lots of options. No, there's a lot of electric cars, but there's not cars that are autonomous and will drive themselves and have all of those features. So that's, that's very true. Where Tesla is basically true. leading the pack. So it's like a, it's like a monopoly. Yeah, actually it is. I was watching a video. Oh my God, it was somebody I was gonna say, streaming. if you were playing Monopoly without me, I would be very upset. No, oh my God, I can't think who it was. But it was so funny because it was, it was a live reaction of this guy realizing what a Monopoly was and that's why the game, the game was, was titled called- Monopoly. It was so funny because it was such a genuine reaction. He's like, oh no, he realized the title. It was like a big streamer too. I can't think of who it was. Oh my gosh, I wish I remembered. But it was really, it was really funny. Actually, it was also really cute because it was like, oh yeah, again. I know. Do you ever have those moments where you like really like, oh yeah? I had one the other day, but I don't remember. I I do. It was what it was. Oh my gosh, what was? You the, know what I thought about the other day when I was wait, walking the dog yeah, outside. Yeah, but hold on. I need to write this down before I forget. Okay, she's okay. writing it down, <laughs> so I can't say what I was thinking well, about. Go ahead. <laughs> okay, I don't. Even go ahead. Know. I was walking the dog, and there's a lot of trees. And at night, there's been a, like an influx of spiders, and I can't Ooh. see them, and they keep getting on me because they're making their webs under the trees. What if a spider bit you in the eye? That's what you're thinking about. Yep. I mean, what if anything bit you in the eye? What if no, I bit I, you in the eye? Well, it, <laughs> I mean, it's true. It's a bit like think about it. Like you're walking, 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 spider web in your eye, just yeah. Or what if it laid eggs in your eye that quickly? Oh, I don't like yeah, it. Yeah, I don't, that's I don't why like I, it. No, I don't like it either, but I just don't think that it would, I don't know. I you just, don't know. I, you don't know. You don't know. I'm sure like someone's been stung in the eye by like a bee. I bet they have. Oh, I'm, 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 like I'm what, hap- what happens? Well, 
I don't know. I itched my eye so bad that it looked like I had saran wrap over it. Imagine. The other day. I mean, maybe it's, I just don't know. I, um, I just want to say that I wrote down type of wood. I saw. That was in my note. So the other day I actually oh. started crying because I could not, this is, this is almost on par with Monopoly. Um, I, so like, <laughs> I don't know, like looking up desks or something. I was like, oh, like a walnut. And I was like, oh. The, the type of wood is walnut and walnuts like the nut comes from a walnut tree uh, yeah, y- yeah yeah i mean that's so absurdly just common sense but it was like i never thought about it like whenever we're at home visiting our parents like there's walnuts all over the ground we always step all over are them. they walnuts or are they something else remember we weren't sure if they were a walnut or a chestnut well, and here's the thing. The fact that I didn't make that correlation at the time is very shocking to me. So you know what else is so weird? So our nuts. sister, there's another one in the middle. Okay. She has a baby <gasps> and we haven't got to see the baby, but it's really funny like watching this child learn Learn things. about the world. But it's like- I'm gonna teach her about walnuts immediately. I'm gonna say, listen. She does not have a peanut allergy, which she went. She, good. she got a little. She, she got to try peanut butter at the doctor's. I feel like she's. She, I mean, she could always get one later, right? Yes. Okay. I mean, I became allergic to bananas at like 23. Who does that? Who does that? Who does that? I haven't had a banana. I should do a live stream where I eat a banana and see what happens. Okay. Okay. Okay, well, there's my plan. I also decided I wanted to do a live stream of me baking a pumpkin pie. Okay. So if you want to come over one day, we can um, we can do a live cooking. Okay, I haven't been able to do a live stream in so long. Yes, well, I've just invited you to mine, so now okay. you can't turn it down. That sounds good, I love this. Uh, we were gonna also talk about uh, Samsung FE. Well, we were this gonna is- also talk about that. Back on the Amazon, the uh, streaming service Luna. Oh yeah. This was rumored uh, since last year. Oh, the previously co- codenamed Tempo. Oh my God. Oh, they couldn't do a Tempo because now Tempo is uh, the fitness. fitness. Yeah. Um, I love my Tempo. It's uh, not clear when Luna will launch widely, but it will be initially available on PC, Mac, Fire TV, iPhone, iPad, via web apps. I love a good web app. <laughs> like, what is that? Like, like, well, like a web app? Well, it's basically going to be streaming from the cloud. So I, it's. I mean, I didn't really use Stadia very much because I mean, I play on my PC mostly, yeah. but I feel like these types of things are gonna be so great for, for traveling when people travel again, when no. it happens. 5G. How the heck, oh we, my God, 5G. We're really, really. I was gonna say, how the heck are we still? Dude, it's like been what, six months, seven months? It's been a long time. How many months has it been since March? I was six. Has it been six months? Yeah, over six months. Actually, so March 20th was your birthday. Happy so birthday to me. Six that was months six ago. months ago, over six wow. months ago. I like it's, the controller though. It's they do have purple. a cool controller. C- controller. Contro- they have a controller. I was trying to read Twitch integration, but say controller. Luna will also feature Twitch integration. Inside the Luna experience, players will see Twitch streams for games in the service. And from Twitch, they'll be able to instantly start playing. That's cool. That is cool. But I wonder what that would do to like Twitch watch times. Cause it's like, oh cool. You're playing the game. I'm going to go play the game. Bye. Yeah. Huh. I will say too, just switching around, talking about that type of behavior, uh, picture in picture on the iOS 14 right? has been incredible. Yeah, because it's like I'm trying to write an email and I want to still keep watching my YouTube video. Yeah, well. Well, if you have premium. If you have the premium YouTube, you can still do the picture in picture. I guess they got rid of that for the non-premium YouTube well, users. But before you couldn't listen to it in the background if you didn't have it on either, if you weren't premium. <gasps> so that's not really a new feature. I understand. So, cause I, I've been watching a lot of my friends like on Twitch and I'm just able to like keep the stream up and do other things, which it makes sense. It does. I'm like, this is great. But I don't understand because why would apps not want you to be able to do that? Cause you're keeping them on their app. You have hit the microphone. I have hit the microphone. I didn't think anyone would notice. I saw it. You, I know, you're so next did they. day. But they, they, if they're watching it, you know. Maybe they have me on in the background they and they're doing something else because they have the YouTube premium. And you know what they're ah. doing? Now they're switching over to, and they're rewinding to see Shoot, what you did. I've hit the microphone. I think Hulu also disabled it. So Hulu, I'm, okay. Oh no, a rant. Just small one. It's like, I'm paying for your service already and you still give me still the, get the ads. worst ads ever. And well, they're so the long, they play, I already paid for 500 Let me freaking give services. you a tip. If you, I, we still don't have pop filters. If you go to cancel Hulu, 
They basically beg you to come back and they give you a discount. Sounds, I'm gonna Do you know how many there. times I've canceled? I'm like, I'm, I'm canceling. They're like, wait, please don't go. We'll give you a month free. And I'm like, <laughs> okay, you're fine. And then you forget to cancel it again. Well, here's the thing. Yeah. It's like, I actually, uh, <laughs> yeah. But it, I'm already paying for the service. Now, I can see if maybe there's like one ad, but there's like- There's so many. There's so many. And then the audio gets so freaking loud. It shocks you. Shocks me I'm to like, the core. I feel like, yeah, like it's like, why am I gonna pay the medium price when I'm still basically seeing a ton of ads? It's like, I'm just gonna- I can't. Can I you can't. use Hulu for free and see more ads? Or no, do you have to be- I don't, I don't I'm, know. I'm over it. I'm not sure either. The only thing I watch there is um, Handmaid's Tale. I didn't like this. I couldn't get into it. It is a lot. I'm it's, like, it'll this put you in a mood. Dumb. I didn't like it. I didn't like anything about it. Love it. Didn't Absolutely like love it. anything about it. I was like, there will be not one single person that will ever tell me what to do. And then I got mad. So Samsung. Yeah. So, so they, Samsung has uh, recently announced the Galaxy S20 FE. This isn't a revolution in mobile tech, but it's what 2020 calls for is what CNET said. That's what they said. They're saying it right here. I'm also looking at it. FE stands for the fan edition. Fan I edition. love the colors. When we were watching the um, the announcement of this, for some reason, I love the orange one. The Oops, orange, and I hit the mic. The orange looks really good. I don't know why I love the orange because I think it remind, reminds me of like- um, Pumpkin. Sherbert. Do you do like you, Sherbert? Do you like Sherbert? Oh my God, I've never heard you say Sherbert? Sherbert before in your life. Well, you've never had orange Sherbert. I have. I've never seen you have it. Well, because I- Do you have it privately? <laughs> like, I'm so confused as to when the Sherbert. Like, you, I, what? I love a good private Sherbert. <laughs> Would you do this weekend? I ate sharp. <laughs> I'm not gonna. I don't. Like, I mean, what? I used it looks to get fit. it whenever we would play softball in like middle school. Okay, we maybe would I always, was too. I was too young. Yeah, we I don't would remember go to the, the We would go to the place that has the cows that I don't want to say where it is. The place I know the place that has with the cows. cows I'm the very ice. well. Yeah, well aware of the place and with the cows. And they had Sherbert. The price is seven hundred dollars, the same as the iPhone eleven. The what iPhone is? eleven is seven hundred dollars now. What is Sherbert? Wait, the iPhone eleven? Oh my god! Wait a minute. It says Sherbert, pronounced Sherbut. Sherbut. Have I been pronouncing it wrong my whole life? Look, Sherbut. Well, okay, Sherbut. Picture this. Okay, you're saying Sherbert. Where is the second R? It, but that's how it's spelled. Sher Sherbet. Sher Sherbet. <gasps> but Sherbert. There's no second oh. R. <laughs> Sher Sherbet. Tyler, right now, Sherbert is scratching. His I have thought that it was wait my whole life. Can we go to a pronunciation? <gasps> go to go to a pronunciation. <gasps> oh, look, Sherbert. It's, so this there's no second R. Sher, oh my god, Sherbet. this is no sorbet. Look at this, Sor no, look, mm. this is a podcast. We listen. Yes. Okay. I know, but there is a there is a discrepancy on the internet. Go to Sherbert pronunciation. It's called Sherbet. With an additional R and the second syllable and pronounced Sherbert is less commonly used. I am less common. I also say Sherbert. It says in Britain, Sherbert is a sweet powder used to make a drink bubbly or eaten. I mean, I'll tell you what, I, when, I used, go to to the, the when I used to go to London, I was the there was like nothing else to do. But you would just eat like drink and party fish there. Fish and chips. And, go, fish and, and you would go to the casino. I would go to the casino. I wasn't even there, but I knew about it. Okay. Sherbert. I wish, does YouTube still have the, the poll, which we're not gonna do. I think it got rid of the poll. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Oh, you can make it, turn it on slow. Watch this. Sherbet. Sherbet. Sherbet? Oh my God. Tyler, put your headphones on. You gotta Sh hear this. Sherbet. 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 No. No. I refuse. Hold on, wait, let me do the slow version. Ready? Sherbet. Sherbet. I've never. Okay, East Coast, we say Sherbert. We do say Sherbert. A Sherbert, Sherbert, Sherbert. I feel, I don't actually know how to feel right now. Oh my God. Tyler, how do you say it? Have you ever said it? Right? Sherbert. Why are we all dumb? There's no second R. I don't understand. Okay, here's a Sherbert. video Sherbert. that says, why Sherbert. do the majority of people pronounce mm -hmm. Sherbert wrong? Snack break. I love how it says snack break. Oh, I'm getting an ad. This is Sherbert, and this is why you've been pronouncing it wrong your entire life. Why? First, let's define sherbet. Sure. The name sherbet. distinction is in the percentage of milk, milk or, or cream. cream. Sorbet often contains no dairy. Oh. Sherbet is anywhere between one to 3% milk fat, mm. and ice cream is usually anything above 4%. Okay, I just like a cold cream, you know? So is sherbet actually a thing? 
Yes, it's a thing. But Sherbet? Sherbet? Sher- Sher- Sherbert? Next up. How did we get here? We are willing to bet that we're you're about pronouncing something. incorrectly the extra R. Oh my God, I can't believe this. Okay. I'm, I'm saving this video. We're going to get a got, copyright strike. No, using just, their content. It's, we have to, this has to be seen. This is fair. Sure, Bert. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Okay. So I just typed that as I was saying it. So, okay. We've been pronouncing Sherbet. Sherbet. I don't even know how to say it anymore. Galaxy. So we got here because of the phone. Uncomfortable. Orange. Do you remember? Okay. 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 A creamsicle. No, listen. Oh. They were the push pops. Yes. Yes. That they had. Yes. That was orange Sherbert. I thought it was a creamsicle. C- creamsicle Sherbert. Is that what cream- a creamsicle is? is? We don't know. We're having push pop. Push pop orange. Ice cream. Just hit orange. Is it freaking Sherbert? Okay, maybe not. I, I, freaking look at this! Look at this! Orange Sherbert frozen push pop. Is it the original kind? This oh. is it. This okay, is, so those are good. That's what I'm on. This is, that is right there. She's aggressively this, pointing at listen, her MacBook. Aggressively. This is like the brand. It's like Market Pantry. It had that freaking colorful wrap around it. I think Market Pantry, isn't that like Target's brand? Yeah, I don't know. I just so that's not. It's our, probably not that, but it looked like that. It yeah. So push pop. Okay, so push I, pop. We, well, didn't some of them have like the the little <gasps> like treats. vanilla? Oh my god, it's so I can't believe it. I'm having okay. So okay, so the Samsung, Samsung Galaxy, Galaxy S F E S twenty F E. It has a six point five inch Super AMOLED. Okay, very nice dimensions. Uh, not are announced yet. Uh, the weight one hundred ninety grams. Android ten. Obviously, they have been announced. Twelve meg. Not on this website. Okay. Not twelve on this megapixel website. camera. Twelve megapixel. It has the three times telephoto. Wow. Front facing. Since it has a thirty two megapixel in the front facing. Oh, these colors look good. Four K. We have the Qualcomm Snapdragon eight sixty five five G. I love a good Snapdragon. I love a good Snap. I had the best time at the Qualcomm Snapdragon like oh. convention. I was so sad I wasn't able to make it. It was fun. I had fun for both of us. Oh, I know. I had to go buy a shirt at the gift shop because I was sweating. I was <laughs> okay. Like, it was very hot. You could add some sherbet. No. Sherbet. Sherbet. I'm so, so upset. So the price off contract is six ninety nine USD. Special features: we have one hundred and twenty hertz refresh rate, support for thirty watt fast charging, and fifteen watt fast wireless charging. Ooh. 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 I love fast were you, charging. Were you going to say spooky? No, I was started thinking about the fact that I have an Xbox <gasps> Series X, and so do you. Next gen, next gen. Oh my god, I've been playing. I've been we playing. You've been playing. Any, we, we aren't we saying anything aren't about saying it. Anything about anything. I just want to say it makes me. We happy. have it. If it makes you happy, it makes me happy. Then it's gonna be a video. It's a next game. gen console. Next. Gen, it's uh, it's next gen. I just keep tweeting next gen because I don't want to say anything about how much either. fun I'm having. I don't either. But um, it's really it's something that makes me happy because oh, it makes Jenna happy. It does. Speaking, gaming, especially because we've been home for so long, like gaming has been saving me. I mean, honestly, like I'm, we've been so busy working. over here doing a lot of things that I've hardly had time to even exist outside I, of. I've, Editing. I haven't been great at doing my job. I but like I was looking at my screen so much that I ordered <sighs> blue blocking glasses because I got a mm. migraine. Blue light blocking glasses. Yeah, Warby, Par- like- Warby Parker. Well, expensive. Well, those look nice. Well, I thought they were gonna have a, a pink tint to them because that there was like a version that I was looking at, and then I think I clicked the wrong thing and hit order, and it was like the middle of the night. So this, those look good though. Did you know there's a Warby Parker store in uh, Santa What's Monica? What's a store? A store. I know. I drove What's past. What's a store? I drove past it because I was going to get my hair cut. The one thing that I've done in the past three months. <laughs> Super exciting. I was like, wow, I'm outside. Like there's hey, people. Those look nice. I like them. No, the blue is, it's like, it's nice. You want to try them on? Yeah. Put those on your little peepers. Oh, I MC. think, I think that if we had to pick a sponsor, Warby Parker would be interested. You think? In, like this is quality content and. What do I look like? Like I love their glasses. I'm scared. They're not a sponsor. I'm just saying that. Like they, I really like them. They look cute on you. If we have bank accounts and <laughs> Jenna has Venmo and she's willing. <laughs> I kind of, I don't know. They look better on you. Well, I mean, they're just kind of what you would, what, no. How do you know they look better on me? I, I, I see you. you. No, they look better on you. I think I got makeup on them. 
That's okay. I have makeup on too. We ha- oh, I hit the mic again. We she have hit. We have the same makeup. Those are comfortable though. They feel nice. Uh, very comfortable. Wow. Very I cool. like. I went through the website, and you can even do like try on pairs. This is not sponsored. Oh I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I actually to. genuinely had an incredible experience. And you know what's the best part about it's like some sponsorships is a lot of them are things that I like. You know, I don't want to tell people. But like I would have done this for free. Don't tell them that. Know, you, your bank I'm account sorry. be empty. I'm, uh, yeah, which is a problem because a lot of people think that all this stuff that we do, like a lot of it, is sponsored, and it's just this is genuine excitement. Once again, if it's sponsored, we're going to say this is sponsored, or it will say ad or sponsored. Like I will say it so many times. There was this video that I was working on. I had to say it so many times. Required from the brand. Yeah. Or sometimes they do text overlay too. Oh no, we do. We do text overlay. But I was saying, I was like, oh my god, I said, I said that this video was sponsored more times than I said anything else in the video about what it was. Me too. And I'm like, so, I don't even care. I want to cover it. I want to cover all the bases. Like, do you want me to get an ad tattoo on my he- my forehead for this one? Because I will. I just want people to know that it is, and it's great because a lot of the stuff that I've been doing recently. Like it's been really fun stuff. It has been like, fun. I've been reviewing a lot of different uh, like PCs. Mm-hmm. Me too. Oh my gosh. Me too. This HP project that I just did, like it was, I think it was one of my favorite things out of like the the most recent videos that I've done that I've worked on. I was like, this thing is so great. And a lot of the times too, like these companies will reach out and we'll get to try the product before being like, yeah, yeah, we'll take like, we'll take, I'm like, let me try it. Like, make sure it's like something that we actually like and yeah. we're actually going to use. And then I'm like, oh my God, this is really cool. So it's, pretty cool that we're able to like try these new things that we might not have ever tried before. I mean like tempo, <gasps> which again, I tried that for over a month before I agreed to do the video mm-hmm. and it's great. Like it's I really love cool. it so much. Um, that's the fitness thing I, we did a video about that I feel like I talk about every single time. I love it, episode. I love it. Jenna got one now I too. did, I did, it's so great. Like I haven't looked my living room, which cause it's like, I mean, you know, Los Angeles, not, it's not the most, let's see, what am I trying to say here? It's. Uh, I mean, I I have a lot of space, but like not enough space for an extra gym. So I just like have it in a corner and it's so like compact and like fits nicely. And I'm loving it because I will never be able to go back to a gym. Nope, never again. Well, it's funny because whenever you, I told you, I was like, yeah, I think you should maybe put it in your living room. I was like right there in that corner. I know it works out great. I'm honestly, I'm like, do I just get rid of one of my couches and put a treadmill there too? Maybe. Are we at the point where I'm just getting rid of my couch and I'll put a treadmill there? Well, I don't know. On that same note, I feel like I didn't even realize that gyms weren't open anymore because I feel like everyone has started adapting to like this new way of life. Yeah. I mean, I'm definitely very grateful to be able to have a treadmill, but like, even if I didn't, I mean, people, like I see so many people running outside now. Yeah. You just find other ways to do things because it's, this you is the new, this to. is it. And I have to, I know. Although the one thing about running outside was it was so tough. Cause it's like when all the fires, the smoke was so mm-hmm. bad, like you couldn't go outside. No. So it's like, okay, our one thing of freedom we had, and now we can't even go outside that we really are stuck in our house, which is another thing where I'm like, well, I'm kind of glad that I do have masks because I'm like filtering out all this, mm-hmm. you know, which is why hazardous. I like that one that yeah. I showed you before. Cause it has like a bigger filter in it. Um, but I know we're talking about video games before. We were? I, well, we were, I don't know, at some point before we started talking oh. about Sherbert, um, <laughs> Nintendo. Okay. This is <gasps> so freaking exciting. This is Super Mario 3D. So this has some of our favorite games, Jenna. Like you oh have to get this. Okay. Wait, can I buy it right now? Digitally? Yes. Super Mario 64, 19... 19- 96. I was seven. I, uh, I was little. No, this was like, let's see, seven. I would have been how old? Seven, eight, nine, I 10, like 11, 12, 12, 13, six. Oh, 11 or 12. Yeah. Which is, I feel like when I really started getting oh into video games, I mean, I had, oh my God, I remember that level, the NES. Um, so I started playing on NES and then we also had a Super Nintendo. Cause I think <gasps> I started playing video games when I was probably like five. Oh my God, they just did the jump through the picture. Yep. Wait a minute. So this is 64, also Super Mario Sunshine 2002. And then hold on, Jenna, wait until you see this. No, it's gonna be the galaxy. Yes, shut up. Shut, shut up. up. No, wait. Sorry for yelling. I'm so sorry. This, I will never forget. Like we used to, what game me, console was this? The uh, Wii? Wii? The Wii? Yeah. Like the original Wii? Yeah, so this oh is what me God. and Jenna, we used to play Super Mario Galaxy together and then I mean, like sometimes you basically were like second player. So like you would basically yeah. just bub up 
bubble. The bubble. Like you would do the bubble. Oh my God. We brought the console with us on family vacations. Mm-hmm. And that's like all we would do is, well, not all we would do, but like every night we would play the game. And Brienne's like, what are you doing? What are you saying? Like, what are you guys doing? Because we would just yell, bub, 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 bub. So, because if you would start dying, you could, you could just, you could do the bubble and then you'd save yourself. And then, like, I can oh, pop your God. bubble and then you could come down. Like, whatever. I can't believe it. I know. We should. Oh my gosh. I, you should stream this. I know I haven't had time. I haven't had time to stream at all. And I'm so sad. I feel like I've neglected everybody, but it's like my bit of sanity is like the, the little bit of time that I would have had to have done any type of streaming. I was like, I need to just sit or like sit, go to sleep. Yeah. Like I've been tracking my sleep on my Apple watch. <gasps> and let me tell you, I normally go to bed at like nine to 10. <gasps> and it, it, this is, I've been going to bed at like one. Like oh, it's really yeah. bad, really bad. And then getting up at like six oh, or five. Yeah, I've been going to bed early. really late. Only cause I keep watching shows on Netflix. There's also the Super Mario 64 original soundtrack, 36 tracks oh and God. the Super Mario Sunshine and Super Mario Galaxy. Dude. Oh my God, Mario Galaxy. Like I just, I just have so many fond memories of us playing that game together, like well, at then, home. I know. And then I've been playing, cause I didn't realize if you have like the monthly subscription for the Nintendo stuff, like you can play all of like the, um, like the Mario, uh, what am I trying to say? The, oh, like the Super school. Mario yeah. World. And oh my God, I was playing that the other day. That game was my favorite. Like mm-hmm. I probably beat it like, I don't even know. Well, I just feel like Super Mario 64 for me was yeah. when I was at an age that I could really like understand yeah. video games and comprehend it. And I had friends that were also mm-hmm. playing video games. So it was sort of one of those things where, I, oh, like, this game, just just looking at it, all these, like the little penguins. I like, know. Oh my God, it's all coming. It's all coming, coming back. It's all coming back to me now. Yeah, we won't. We don't know the words. Sweet. I hit yeah, the well, microphone again. Um, wow. So yeah, so this is really exciting. And I think it's actually only available for a limited time, which <gasps> is kind of crazy. So if you are going to get it, get it now. Oh my God. I know. And I think that you should get it. Okay. Well, because I, I mean, like you should get it. I have to find my Nintendo Switch. I, don't I know where it is. love it. Oh God, I just love video games. Like it's I love them great. so much. There's so many. And it's only like only more games are coming out. We're gonna have the new Call of Duty soon. <gasps> oh my gosh, I haven't even had time to play Tony Hawk. I've only played like a couple times. It's funny because I keep doing the same tricks over and over and over Me too. again. And I'm like, you need to expand. You need new tricks, but, but I, I can't. just keep because I like my brain only memorizes like a few of them. Yeah, and I'm, I'm like, like, oh, Ow. it's time for my special. Okay, well, I don't remember it now. I, know. I need to get like a cheat sheet and like have it like in front of me. I maybe I'll, oh like oh I can pull up the duo and have a little yes that's a nice cheat sheet oh or like something or like oh my god I love the duo I it's still really love it oh I also have a video coming out um it came out already yesterday wait what is today is today what did it say Thursday today is Thursday tomorrow. okay good because I have a video posting Friday and if today is Saturday that you guys are listening it to this yesterday then I posted it yesterday it is the Tom Brown edition of the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold why have you not showed it to me. It's literally sitting right over there under my unboxing desk. I guess you wouldn't see it because it's in the box. It's in the box. Let me tell you, this unboxing experience was so premium. I mean, this obviously is a very expensive kit because you get the the Galaxy Watch, you get the- You get the, the Watch? Buds, yeah, you get the Buds Live. Oh my God. And you get the Z Fold and you get all of these custom bands and the packaging. I need to show it to you after this yeah, or you I mean, just like, go watch the video, but oh it is God. like unbelievable. Like the. The attention to detail, obviously Tom Brown being a designer, like this is, all of that carries over to this. Like the USB cable, get this, has like this nice little ribbon around it. Oh my God. And it has a button, like a, a little button. button. It looks so great. It's like when you used to stay at like a nice hotel and they would tie up your cables for you. Yes. I'm like, oh my God. Like Tom I'm just Brown. just gonna untie you, but like, thank you. Tied up the cables. Oh my god! And then each little cable and like the battery comes in like this really nice little bag. Bag, like a soft little velvety bag. And then there's like custom sounds on the Z Fold too. Like if you are a Tom Brown fan, like this is the ultimate package. That's insane. I'm excited to look I at can't it wait and also you watch it. your video. Yeah, it's, I'm actually excited to see the video because Tyler edited it. So I haven't watched <laughs> you it You get yet. to relive it all again. <laughs> That's cool. You got I, some really cool like close up shots of like detail stuff. Cause we use the, um, is it the 150? 135. 135, oh my God. Oh my, you, you, so, oh wow. Oh, you must have, crisp. You must've been like outside crisp. shooting that. So crisp. Oh man, oh, I'll have to see it. It's, it's pretty cool. Oh, There's so many so devices excited. coming out. It's just like, how I'm do we keep up? Going to need to take some time off, I think. 
at the beginning of the year or during the holidays of no tech because I'm so incredibly like overwhelmed yeah. and so overstimulated that like, I, I just don't even know what to do. I think it's why I have trouble sleeping too because like, my brain just won't turn off. It's just like thinking about all the things I should be doing, I could be doing, or I'm on my phone, I'm scrolling or I'm watching TV. There's just too much. As soon as my head hits that pillow, I am like a rock. I'm oh. like a sack of potatoes. I'm out. I'm like a potato with restless leg syndrome. Oh, mm -mm. so not not the same at all. No, I should just look at my sleep data. See how how my sleep is doing. I need to. Uh, I have the watch downstairs. I haven't unboxed it yet. I've still been watching. Can you do the sleep stuff with the other watches or no? I think actually you can, because I think it was a new was a feature watch in WatchOS Seven. Um, What's the app? Is it just called Sleep? Uh, well, uh, no. What's this one. Look at this. Okay. Average time in bed, seven hours and 26 minutes. Average time asleep, six hours and 30 minutes. Oh my God, that, mine- Look at this. Look how that last night I was absolutely dead. I did not wake up at all. I didn't think oh I moved God. in from 1230 until 6 a.m. How, what is your secret? I guess you're probably just working hard. Maybe I should try that. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I'm usually, I mean, this day was really bad. That was whenever the Apple Watch video <gasps> was gonna be posted. I had to get up at like five and then I went back to sleep. So what see. do you do? Do you just like activate on your watch? Like you're going to sleep? I turn on the bedtime thing. So like last night I went to bed. So I was like, okay, I'm probably gonna fall asleep around 1230. And then I had my schedule to wake up at 8 a.m. or 6 a.m. So you do it on the, on your phone? <clears throat> yeah. And then when you swipe down from here up on the top of the watch or when you swipe up, there's a little bed. See a little bed? I don't bed, have a little bed. Little bed. You have a little bed up. Swipe up. You have a little bed? No. Yeah. You have a bed. So now you go sleep. And I have a bed. the... Apple or the iPhone alarm was so alarming. Like it's like, I have like the the automatic one on, like whatever's oh God. It's just like, it's, a, it's like it jolts you awake. Yes. Like it was, oh my God, so it's terrifying. Even though I don't like wearing a device to sleep, this so gently wakes you up that it was like incredible. Like this morning, like it was just like a little small tap, small tap. And you then know I what? Up. I've noticed though my, so I'm still wearing the ceramic one from the series five. I love the it's ceramic one. It's been dying a lot quicker. Probably watch OS seven. Yeah. It's like, mm. it's like, I look down, I'm like, oh, you're dead. Huh. Oh, huh. I feel like they'll probably come up with an update after since that is the, it still is new. For sure. No, 100%. Cause I'm like, this didn't happen before. So I think it is definitely the watch. This OS. charges so quickly. And so what I've been doing now is, uh, so I guess like, for example, like this morning, um, I woke up, I was like, okay, so I have to, I'm gonna shower. And then I trained for like an hour. And then while I was doing all that, my phone or my watch was charging. Oh. So then I got a notification on my phone and it said, your watch is charged. Oh. And I said, I'm ready for the day. That's pretty cool. I like that feature. The that only problem nice. is I edit, I use my mouse with my, which hand is this? Your right. This is my right hand. <laughs> I don't know my left and right. Uh, so like my mouse always kind of like, kind of just gets in the way. So I do sometimes take it off when I'm editing. That makes sense. I mean, you're not really doing anything so it's like you're standing. My so. competition with Marquez is not going well. Oh. He beats me every time. What's he doing? Everything. He's so fitness. talented. Who has time for fitness? Well, I did run for an hour today, but that's Oh still, my God. But here's the problem is I'm not getting my max points because I'm not getting my stand goal because I've been sitting and editing. <laughs> That's a problem. That's a serious problem. It is a problem. I don't know what to there tell you. There's something else I was gonna talk about, but now I don't remember. Do you remember? Was it the Theragun? <gasps> yes. Okay, speaking of fitness and trying to feel better, this is the Theragun Mini. Okay. It's got a really cute little I case. I don't know how I have survived this long without ever having a Theragun. Like with all the crazy training and like my muscles are always hurting, this thing's amazing. You guys can't see it if you're an audio, but it's like the mini. Do you mean give me? I've me, been getting a lot of targeted ads for it. Probably, oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God, it's coming at me. It's coming okay, at move me. Move your hair. I'm gonna give, I'm gonna give you a treatment, Jenna. Okay. It's coming at me. So, My shoulder hurts. Here, okay. Now. <laughs> I'm a little scared. How's that feel? Does that, that feel, feel good? That actually feels nice. That's not too bad. Yeah, I don't want to put it too hard because I know you're Jenna sensitive. I've got real sensitive muscles. How's that feel? It feels nice. But, let me get your other. Let oh. me get. Let me get your other side. Just turn. Uh, here, let me. Give you, let me get that arm. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here's your arm. Ooh, that feels nice. Does it feel like you like that? That feels That's ni nice. Yeah, that feels real nice. Dude, this thing's amazing. I mean, especially because we. I mean, I wouldn't get massages that often, but it would definitely 
get out. Oh, well, that's where it hurts. Really? Are, Not, you, are you okay? Yeah. It, it, it's just I've got like knots. Get them out. Get them out. I don't want to do too hard because I know get you're out, sensitive. Get that knot out. Am I, I even touching you? Because I can't tell. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't want to push too hard and hurt you. Yeah, that feels nice. Because Jenna, sense, she gets I sensitive. I haven't had a massage in so long, which I realize is a very first world problem, but like. They're good for you. It is very good for you. And I have, and okay, I, where would you else? Let me, let me put this on your um your hip. She's like, going to say, let's see, you're putting your butt. Okay, she's putting it on uh, my butt. butt. It's your butt muscle. Oh my God. Does that feel good? I did squats yesterday. Yeah, see, this is nice. <laughs> I'm getting the butt massage. <laughs> it feels so good. Like that, oh man. Yeah, like that, that does hip. feel nice. Yeah, that oh, it gets. Oh God, this is great. Oh, and I found it out. This thing's so great. Honestly, can't. I like sit. it. Enough. So I also got the uh, the elite version, which is a real big boy. Oh my god! You have to show me that after. That I will. Nice. It's great. But this one is really nice because it's super small. I feel my body still vibrating. Me too. Ooh. It feels so good. Oh, my muscles. Everything just hurts. Same. Hurts. 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 Same. I uh, I don't know how. I don't. Well, there's something else I was going to talk about. Oh, I wanted to talk about um, the ASUS and the acronym laptop. You didn't watch my video yet, I did haven't you? Yet. I'm so sorry. Oh, Jenna, I spent so much time on this video. I know, because every time I came over here, you were editing the video and I was like, I have to, I'm gonna watch it, I'm gonna watch it. So basically I would say about three days. So this kind of just came about like very randomly. Um, so our friend Ed was working on this project and it was this, you know, marketing like this laptop. So then I ended up just doing a random interview with um, Errolson and David who worked on the actual laptop. And Acronym is a clothing company. And so they kind of had this really cool collaboration and they gave them one of these laptops and said, can you just reimagine this, make it, you know, do whatever you want. And it is really cool. I mean, I saw it and it looked cool. Like I, yeah. I haven't watched the video, but I saw what it looked like. I'm like, this is very interesting. It's just not like anything you've really seen before. No, and it's just cool. The fact that like they were able to, you know, even add so many different colors on the keyboard and that they originally had told them, no, you can't use this many colors. And then they ended up being like, okay. Well, it's yeah, crazy. Is the keyboard actually kind of reminded me of like the roadcaster with like mm -hmm. the colored buttons and stuff. I was like, wow. But it was cool That's getting neat. to talk to Errolson and David about like the behind the scenes of like their thought process in design. Because coming from a design background, I just feel like I don't have time to really invest in doing design work anymore because I'm usually editing or have to be on camera or doing yeah. whatever else. But I have such an appreciation for like good design and typography. And listening to David talk about like the type and just serifs and I was like, just, can you just, Talk about type for the next hour, please. Which he did, and it was it was incredible. I have to watch. You have video. to watch I, I, it. I have to. I it's on my list. That is on my list, and Farouk's uh, uh, video, and then I also have to watch your your uh, Z Fold. Oh my gosh. Well, I'm so sad because if I didn't, I didn't realize that we would be doing an actual interview and talking that long. Because we talked for like over an hour and a half. Oh. And I was like, shoot, this could have been a perfect podcast episode, but I didn't oh, shoot it been. in the way that would have worked out for a podcast, but it was just a really good conversation. And I'm, I'm sad that we weren't able to share the full thing with you, but this video, like I basically did nothing for three days except edit that. It's true. You were very busy. Every time I was like, what are you doing? You're like, I'm editing. And you look cool. I saw some of your cool like graphics and your effects. I was like, very oh, fun. Whoa. Super so, yeah. fun. There'll be a link if you guys want to check that out. And if you're watching this on the YouTube channel. Yeah. Well, hopefully we remember it's on my YouTube channel as I'll well. I'll try to remember. Can you believe we have a podcast? No. This Can is our 15th episode. 15, like I can't believe it. Oh, thank you everybody. I know everybody. Everybody, we're surprised too. Hey, do you know who's over there in the corner? David oh, Blaine. David Blaine. David Blaine's here. Do you think Everybody. we can get him on the podcast? Probably. Why not? I mean, why not? Put it out there in the universe. David. David. We can talk about David. Your magic. We can talk about my magic show that I did in kindergarten. Yes. Yes. And I can. It is. We have video footage of it. We have a video of it, don't we? I think Home videos. Somewhere. Somewhere we'll have to find it. It's Maybe. Very good magic show. I think he would be very impressed. I don't really have anything to talk to him about. I went skydiving and my arm went numb and that would be, that would be the, I'd be like, I was scared. You I are feel brave. Like <laughs> he probably has other things to talk about than just magic. Yeah. Like, I, uh, you know, life. Yeah, life. We can ask him, maybe he likes video games. Maybe he does. We don't know. We don't know. We won't know until he's on. Remember when you used it. to ask people what their favorite snack was? Yeah, I remember when I, yeah, I asked a lot of people that like, um, um, I almost said Jared Leto, but it was, oh my Jeff Bezos. I asked Jeff Bezos. I asked um, Jack Black. Oh, he's um, pretty cool. I feel like he's just like, what was his favorite snack? 
It I probably changed. Remember, since you know what we can do, Jim. Probably changed since then. I th- let's see. I feel like we could get Jack Black on our podcast. He's great. He's gr- he is great, and I feel like he would be like, yeah. Oh, oh my, my gosh. gosh! What? Oh, I probably can't. It's interesting because a lot of the older videos of mine, like they don't show up in search anymore. Probably a good thing. It's definitely. I mean, who said that? I said that. No, it's definitely I didn't a good thing. That. Oh my god, here it is. Oh, it's Jay Leno. Oh my god, I'm just like, who? Oh wow. Oh, we've, we've got, got an ad. We've got, we've got an ad. Because this I'm, is on, from 2008. I'm on same brain and we don't have premium. 2008. Awesome. One What's question up? for you. What is your favorite treat? Oh, your favorite treat? Your favorite treat? I like a quesadilla okay. with uh, Doritos inside. Oh my god. Quesadilla! Oh my god, I look so... You're I look, flipping like, me! Hey, one question for you. What's I'm your so favorite treat? Right, favorite awesome. treat? Yes! Uh, root beer float. Root beer floats. That is delicious. Right. Oh I, my god! I, I feel so I feel so uncomfortable. I'm so embarrassed. <laughs> I don't get what embarrassed. What are you doing? I don't remember. What? Was what? that the video? 34 seconds you posted that. Oh my gosh. YouTube was a different thing in 2008. That's insane. Oh that, god, you basically just posted a TikTok. We're sitting here at the palms and I'm with Ashley. Okay, you remember we did this? We went to, um. So what happened was, is that we, you know, we got into that whole CNN thing and we were doing that. This is it's crazy. crazy. This is a lot. It is true. This is a this lot. This was 2009. So remember when we said your blonde hair was 2011? I think it was 2008. 2008. 2009 uh, blonde hair. Yeah. Oh, look at this. 11 years ago when I met iCarly. Was she even born? Apparently. Yeah, she wow. was. Well, we're almost Miranda. at the hour mark, I just. would love to have Miranda on the podcast. Okay. That'd be cool. We, we are accepting all, all willing guests who yeah. want to use our platform of same brain. Same brain. <laughs> Speaking of, we might have a logo. Well, we do have a oh, logo. Oh, we do. We do. We definitely have a logo. We were going to make an announcement whenever we had merch, but I guess we're sort of making it we're right just now, gonna make at the it end now. of the podcast. Because yeah. anybody, did anybody make it at the end? Maybe if you did. Tweet us out. and let us know that you're excited about the logo. The logo. Yeah! Woo! We do okay. want to work on, we have two items that we have in our in our sm- small same brain that same we brain. want to have for the merch. So we're going to work on that. The it's just, it's going to be a very exciting time. The one piece of merch, I was like, hey, Jenna, this is a really great idea. I think that we should do this. And when I said it, she's like, oh my God, I, I like, had the same idea. Did I already say that? Because like, I feel like I've, I was thinking the exact same thing. You so did not now, tell me that. Now it has to happen because it was the same thought and it's a weird thought. It's not like, it's no, not it's normal. obscure. And when we tell you guys, you're going to be like, wow, yeah, you guys yeah. do have the same brain. Yeah, so I'm excited for that to come to fruition. You, never, you never told me that. Like, no. Like, Maybe back in the day when we were talking about merch. No, like not I, like yes. this. Well, not this specific. Because we never had this logo. Exactly. I'm, I don't even okay, know. Okay, well, we're well, very Well, now we need to go you. do some research on how to make merch. Uh, we do. All right. Maybe we just Google it. I just got tired. Me too. I'm hungry and the dog needs a walk. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for either watching or listening. If you want to leave us a voice memo, you can on anchor.fm slash same brain. We also obviously have been reading the Apple podcasts reviews. And so yes. Jenna, she's in charge of the Instagram account. She also Scary. features a I've been um, featuring review the reviews every episode. every episode on Instagram. Yes, on our Instagram. So make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel, youtube.com slash same brain. We are we also on Twitter and Instagram are. as same brain. Wow. All the places, same brain. That's a I'm lot. I'm so happy. I'm, I'm so excited. Barely about it. functioning on, on like my own YouTube channel. So yeah, well, going, going you know, here's to start another one. <laughs> okay. All right, guys. Thank you so much for listening and we'll see you again next week. Bye. Oh, oh my God. Oh. That was us. Sherbert. 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 I can't believe it's Sherbert. <laughs> <laughs>